Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing my first food review. It's called Pho and Chill, located in Linwood. Let's go. You can see their menu. So it's called Pho and Chill Street Food. Here's their menu. There's people around and I'm still nervous about videoing, so I'll talk more about it. But I'll show you videos of the food and I'll put a link below uh, the menu. I think they have a website, if I'm not mistaken. Just opened this year. So there's people around and I may want to, I'll show you an ending of what the restaurant looks like inside. But pretty much I ordered a pho, spring rolls, mussels, uh, duck soup, and then chicken soup with white noodles. And I don't want to butcher the Vietnamese name, so I will try to ask the waiter to pronounce them and see what he says. But no guarantees. And I also got a Ube cream coffee, I believe. So starting off, we got the fresh spring rolls. Um, usually it comes with the pork and shrimp and this awesome dipping peanut butter sauce. This is one of my favorites of any Vietnamese restaurant and I could eat roll eat numerous of these. So as you can see, let's try it out. So they have like a crunchy things here. It's pretty good. The peanut sauce, some of them I feel like they're either too runny or sometimes too thick. This one's really good. Yeah, so one of my favorite soups I had in pho style is of course pho. And this is a specialty one, so this has like beef link and then it has like the meatballs from pretty much. This is a specialty pho. Um, the way good this one has, so pretty much pho is just a, a soup and it takes a really, like a noodle soup with vermicin. Um, so what a lot of people know commonly with Vietnamese food is pho and I chose a specialty one. So it's pretty much beef link, it has meatballs as well. And then what's my favorite part is the tendon. I like to try all the, uh, especially the broth before adding all the other stuff to it, which you could, what could with poison sauce, sriracha, and this little bundle of joy of like bean sprouts, jalapenos, and uh, lime and all that. So let's here, let's try it. It's nice, that's nice. A good flavored broth and everything. I've been leaning more to eating pho without all the other extra stuff, so I just like been eating it straight. It's rich, very rich. So this is I believe the number 10 on the pho and it's a specialty one or if you just say specialty and they'll understand which one you're talking about. All right let's try this uh, noodles. That's good. That's good. Some beef plank. Mm. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. So here is the chicken one. So this one from, I asked a friend on Instagram about it and she was said, I go, which ones do you choose? And she said, this is one, so it's with wider noodles. So I'm usually a, just a pho person, but I have tried Bundaway. If I mispronounce that, I'm so sorry. It's spicy soup and that's my other favorite soup. But this one looks interesting. All right, so here we go. Oh. oh my, that one's good. It's not spicy, but uh, how do I describe it? It's like a curry style, it seems like. I could be wrong, but it is good. This one is the steamed clams. I think I ordered too much. It's all good. Soup and then with a little of the clam. Mm. 
That's nice. That's a good this clamp. Is the duck one. So it comes from the side, and I understand they say you can combine it or you can just yellow the soup and then the duck. This is the last dish I got, and then the coffee whenever it comes out. So we'll add this to there and try it. That's good. I'm glad I tried something else. Thank you. It's rich and it's like, it doesn't have like the other flavors like fun and everything where the broth is overwhelming. It's a real clean taste. It's like a Vietnamese ube cream. It's good. I think I ordered too much noodles, but everything I tasted is good. There's a lot of people and I'm still not used to vlogging, but I'll tell more when I get home or when I can wrap up the video. This is my first time doing a food vlog, so I might review this video and make it more justice. Hey guys, so I just want to finish up that video and wrap it up. Sorry for the sun. It's pretty much, is so it's fun, chill. It's a good place. There's just a lot of people around at the time and I'm not comfortable about vlogging yet in public. And pretty much there's a lot of seats so I didn't want to really show the restaurant inside. I didn't want to show the format. So I apologize about that. But the food was good. It was really good. I'm not just saying that because I know the owners and all that and they're not. I'm not just doing it. I like food and I'm more than happy to tell what's good food out there and everything. And I enjoyed it. Uh, so all the dishes, I think uh, my favorite was that chicken uh the chicken one with the wider noodles that one was a game changer i didn't know about it i'll definitely order it i am no expert in vietnamese food like i said but i have been trying more dishes outside of pho and like the spring rolls and stuff trying there uh like i said i like to speak uh, i'm definitely gonna go back and try their spicy soup that's one of my favorite ones it's pretty much on that aspect their pho was good the broth was good the spring rolls were good everything was good uh their menu was big Definitely, I think I ordered too much noodle dishes, so maybe next time I was um, moved around different ones, but definitely go check it out. It's located in Linwood, but it's like right on the border of Everett and Linwood. I'll put the address below, their website below, so you can look at their menu. Definitely check it out. Small business. They just started up, I think, um, a little in, in like around August time, and pretty much it's just, I, I just, I hope they do well, and I hope you all decide to visit them. Give them a shout out. Go visit them. Tell them I sent you. I don't know if you're going to get a discount, but definitely go check it out. Um, if you want, definitely want to make more videos. Hopefully I get more comfortable, but especially about visiting different restaurants and just helping out smaller businesses, giving them like, you know, that, uh, you know, marketing out there that they deserve. So, so many great businesses out there. Uh, I love food. I like making videos like this. So I'll definitely try in the future. So definitely go check it out. Check out my other social medias. Everything, the restaurant address, name and everything, description will be in the description below. I hope you like this video. Give it a like, share, and of course, enjoy, take care, and God bless.